Hey everyone, Gary Simon of Corsetro. So today we're going to take a look at a specific company called bookmark.com. And if you've been paying attention in the development world, at least here in 2018, then you'll know that the topic of artificial intelligence and deep learning is a big and growing industry. And bookmark.com touts itself as being an AI website builder. So I can guarantee you in the coming years, this type of thing is going to only grow. And I'm not worried about it taking our jobs. What it will do is make our lives a lot easier. If you're dealing with a lot of different web design clients, for instance, and you need a way, a quick and easy way to generate sites that are both customizable uh, and also hosted on a platform that takes care of everything. And that way you really streamline your business model as much as possible. So we're gonna take a look exactly at what bookmark.com is. I'm gonna walk you through the process of what it takes to use their AI builder, which is extremely simple. We're gonna customize and talk about how to customize a site real quickly, and then how to add clients and it will handle billing those clients. You can choose from eight different price points from $15 all the way to charging your clients $125 per month. And also it includes e-com, there's just a lot of different things. And so we're gonna cover a lot of it. And so let's go ahead and check it out. All right, so here we are at the uh, bookmark.com forward slash agency. And this is a landing page that provides you with uh, a lot of different details uh, associated with the program. So we're just gonna go through these real quick. Um, so you can create websites in minutes. So a fully functional website in less than two minutes. We'll see if that's true because we're gonna go through this. Um, you can choose from 750 business types, unlimited websites and pages included. They're all responsive and mobile friendly and they leverage artificial intelligence to maximize conversion and user engagement. So we'll see about that too. Um, you can showcase multiple websites effortlessly. So when you use this AI builder, uh, after you answer these, you know, just a few questions, it will present you with a number of different websites based on the industry type and the business type. Interesting. Um, you can also start making money today in the sense that uh, they have what's called an, an agency, a design agency program. Um, and so really, it lets you focus on the design and bookmark will handle all your billing and that's optional and we'll talk about that in a bit. Um, and you can also choose the price to, to charge your clients anywhere from 15 to $125 per month. Um, and you get paid 60% of that for the lifetime of every client. All right, so I'm coming down here. We'll look down here more. Uh, Stripe is handling all of the billing for your clients. And they also give you access to uh, Post Affiliate Pro, which is a third party script where you can view statistics uh, and, and see basically exactly, you know, how much you're going to be earning uh, based on your clients. So. Just a few other bullet points here. You could sell unlimited products. There's no transaction fees. All websites uh, for your clients will have SSL security. So that's a plus, especially with the, the changes that are going through Google. And coming down here, there are also online courses that are included. There's no coding required, although you can still plug in a certain module so you, you can have more fine control over different elements of the sites. And you'll see that when we get to that part. And everything is hosted on AWS so you know it's really fast. And here we go. So basically for $99.95, you get access to this design agency program, which basically includes that AI website builder and customizer. And then also this other design agency portion where you can handle all of your clients in this area. So let's go ahead and check this out. And by by the way, one final thing I wanna uh, mention just down here, you could choose from eight approved monthly packages that you can charge your clients, ranging from 15 bucks a month to $125 a month, of which you get 60% of. Or if you just wanna handle billing the clients yourself, then you pay a flat rate fee of either uh, between 12 and 25 dollars a month to bookmark so let's hit start now all right so this is the uh the area after you create uh, an account um that you'll be uh, forwarded to and so there's just different tabs up here your website that's the first thing i'll check out and so you basically as uh, an agent you have your own agency website if you want to use that all right so um 
you can, of course, check this website out if you want. You can edit it, for for instance. Um, if I click on edit here, I, as you can see, I have not made any adjustments, but they have quite a robust uh, system here, uh, basically a website builder from which you can go ahead and make adjustments to. Um, we'll check that out uh, in a little bit though. But really, if we click on your clients right here and create new client, and we'll say this is you know somebody that you know perhaps if you you deal with local web design clients or you know there's a brick and mortar businesses whatever, uh, this is where you put in their their information. So their your client's email address. I'm just going to put John at Doe.com. Going to put in uh, John Doe. And down here, like I mentioned before, um, we have our payment options where Bookmark will handle billing your client. You don't have to mess with anything. And that's, you know, that can be a real pain if you don't have that set up right on your own. Um, and you can choose between two plans and we can see the professional plan or the business plan. So if you look at the price points for uh, the price per month, you can go from $15 to $99 for the professional plan. But if you have a client that requires e-commerce and selling stuff, um, then these price points change from 35 month uh, to uh, $125 a month. All right, so we'll just choose professional and we'll charge our client $30 a month of which we would get 60% of. And then um, we could also do option two where the agency bills a client and you handle this yourself. So if you choose that, then you just choose from one price point between two options, professional plan at 12 bucks a month or a business plan at $25 a month. So we're just gonna choose this one up here and hit save. All right, awesome stuff. So now we have John Doe and we see we can have this uh, request payment button and we can modify client details and hit login and all of that good stuff so what we can do if we want to create john doe's website now we simply hit login and this will log you into john doe's account all right so john doe will also be able to log into this very same account and they can even if they wanted to they can lock you out if they don't want you making changes anymore and they're, they're satisfied and they can handle it themselves because it's a really easy system um, but you still get paid for the lifetime you know f for as long as they have their website up here at bookmark.com and if you know anything about web design clients you know these are ty type of clients that will really stick for a long time you know like for, for like a hosting provider but it, this is more than just a host obviously so you have the potential to make a lot of money based on how much you're charging them all right, so now your website's right here. You can click Create Website, and now we go into the AI design portion, uh, and we'll see how this works. So let's hit Start Now, and then search type of website. This is made to be so massively simple. Um, so we'll say it's a photography website. And now you can see there's so many different types here. All right, um, we'll hit Next. So what is the name of your business or website? Um, I'll just put um, Simon Simon Says. I don't know, that's my last name. Not Simon Says though. All right, and then we can hit next. Um, do you need to add e-commerce? Create an online store with a shopping cart. Now if I'm a, a photography business, I probably, I'm not, unless I'm selling prints or something, I don't, I don't need that. So I'm just gonna hit no next. Now, is this your website? All right, let's see. Automatically, it is doing a search on the internet for um, different websites and, and based on the, the names that are associated with here. So I'm gonna say no, we're gonna assume this person doesn't have a website. So we're gonna hit no. So what are your contact details? All right, so the name of the business, that's fine. Um, the phone number you can put in here. I'm not sure if any of this is actually required. Um, I'm just gonna hit next. Yeah, it's not required. What site layout do you want? All right, so you could choose no preference and just go to the next page. But if you know exactly what you want, you can choose one of these options right here. And so, you know, for a landing page, you know, especially in this day and age, it's gonna be between, um, okay, so you could choose a single page where there's a, a, a kind of like a hero section with multiple pages or a single page. Um, we'll go ahead and choose single page and then hit next. 
All right, and then what images do you like? Choose at least two images and these will appear on your website. So uh, we can choose this one and then maybe I can, and by the way, these are all royalty free apparently. Um, and now let's do that one. So it says at least two, so I don't know, I'll do three. We'll hit next. And then what is your website style? All right, so again, when it comes to somebody's business, uh, hopefully they thought about branding and, and when it comes to branding and, and uh, emitting certain emotions, um, this will align with whatever that happens to be. Um, for me, I'll say modern. Now let's hit create your website. All right, so there's a sort of a JavaScript based animation occurring here. And here it is. So sit back, your website will be ready in 30 seconds. Create website. All right, so we have the name up here, Simon Says. And here's a guided tour, which is really handy looking. All right, so it's just basically letting you know exactly how you can modify the website and make customizations to it. And it's still, as we can see, it's right behind me. Um, it says transfer in progress where it's, uh, all right, it just went away. So it basically uh, created the website and tied it to the, uh, the client's account. And here we go. Wow, we got like an, an animated background or a video background here of sorts. All right, so your website is ready. Now simply edit as much or as little as you like. And guess what? All the images and videos in your websites are free. Website is free, so awesome. Um, you can also choose to connect the domain and you can also view pricing uh, associated with this. So if I click that, it's gonna give you just some basic pricing information here. And I'm not going to click connect to domain right now. Just know that you can definitely do that with, which is also uh, with an SSL. And over here, not satisfied with this website. So this is the very first look that you get at the website. Um, you can create a new one, or if you're pretty certain that this is the basic layout that you want, then you can go ahead and click start editing this website. All right. So. If we click create new website, as we can see, it's saying that all websites are created and stored and can be accessed inside the your website menu from the dashboard that we saw earlier. And now it's you don't have to run through that same process. It already has your your answers through all the, through the different um, forms that we filled out, but now it's just going to generate a different website for us to check out. So what it's doing, I thought initially it was a guided tour, but really it's actively creating the website in front of us. All right, so I was wrong initially about that. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty clever. It's actually a two part thing. It's a guided tour, but it's also actively building out pieces of a website. And it's just showing you, for instance, how easy it is uh, to work in this module based format uh, for creating um, these websites, nice parallax effect here. Yeah, I'm impressed with this, definitely. So let's I uh, let's say we're happy with this one. Uh, let's choose start editing this website, and so here we are. We're in the editor. All right, I can go ahead and there's just more information. So everything's really well explained here. Um, it's going to tell you exactly how to change a website uh, website styles. Uh, fonts, sorry, I'll move out of the way for some of these. You could uh, learn how to customize uh, website sections here, these different sections, and you can see it's all hover based and uh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Uh, search engine optimization it covers, uh, the drag and drop modules where you can put in your own HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, um, and also publishing your website. So there's a lot of stuff here um, and a lot of good documentation on how to do all that. So any of these elements, of course, you can change. You can modify the text by clicking on it. As you can see, the cursor shows up and we have um, different options based on what you're choosing. You know, if this is a text element, you're gonna have bold, italics, underlines. You can make it a link if you want. 
um, text color. Some of them have a background color if it's a button. Um, over here, like for these social media icons, you can go ahead and adjust these by going to settings. And so you can include you know, even more of these if you want. So it's just really robust in terms of the options and how it's based on being component based. All right, so if you go to design, you'll see they have uh, a lot of different options here. So you can choose the style uh, with different layouts. You could choose uh, the background, you can modify all of that stuff. Uh, the page, you can change the color and add an image onto your website's page background and footer has the footer stuff. Just a lot, a lot, a lot of different stuff. Page animation, parallax headers, you can turn on and off. Um, right here, you can add, move, and delete sections of your website right here. So it's kind of based on like this little, uh, this tree orientation. Add sections, add external, just a lot of information. Um, modules, again, tons of different types of modules. So if you wanna have Google Maps, for instance, placed somewhere uh, on the page, then well, let's try that real quick. So add a map with your location marker. So I'll just put this right here and there we go. So you click on it. Of course it has specific settings uh, to adjust the search location. There you go, very, very easy. All right, so let's say at this point, you know, you, you've gone through and you've customized the site for this specific client, then you can go ahead and hit save, all right? And so the page has been saved and it's ready to go. So you can click exit builder. All right, so we're still in John Doe's account, but now we can see this website and it's ready to go. And you could see um, if you wanna set up the domain and such for them, you could choose the get domain option and there you go. So at this point, you would go back to your main account. All right, and you can see once again, if we go to uh, your clients, we have our John Doe here. And then, of course, you could click on, at this point, request payment, and this will shoot off an email to the client where they can then put in their payment information and start actively using their website and all of that. So, theoretically, you can use this for a bunch of different clients and make it so freaking quick that uh, you're not sitting there messing around with code and everything's confined within a single system. And then outside of that, as I mentioned before, there is an e-learning sec uh, section that they have on the site that has a ton of different courses. So if you're maybe you're not familiar with you know what it takes to start an online business, specifically like a design agency, maybe perhaps in your local area, um, then you could take one of their courses. There's a lot of stuff you know that's specific to marketing and the business aspect of it. So you know really it's three things: it's the AI builder, it's the agency, the design agency management system, and then it's also a learning portal portal from which you can gain access to tons of different courses here um, that will definitely benefit uh, most people, even people who are more of an intermediate to advanced um, uh, you know, uh, technician in this field. All right, so hopefully you'll check out bookmark.com. I know for myself, speaking from previous experience where I've had you know over a thousand plus clients, it would have been great to have something like that back in the day because you know, if you're in that position now where you have a bunch of web design clients, then you know firsthand it is a pain. They're always sending you emails about updating the website. I uh, and then maybe it will sometimes become a pain trying to get them to pay you uh, for the services. And so this really handles all of it. It allows you to collect uh, payment information uh, automatically. It also allows them to have their own access where they can quickly and easy, easily make the modifications to the website themselves. And it's really easy, obviously, to generate these websites for these clients with just a few clicks of a button. So hopefully you check it out. Super efficient, very easy to use. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new video. All right, goodbye.